Safety is the top priority for the nuclear industry, and as an outgrowth of the response to the accident at Fukushima in Japan in 2011, the industry recently opened regional response centers near Phoenix, Arizona, and Memphis, Tennessee. But you may not be aware of the extensive nature of backup equipment that's on the plant site. Behind me is the Flex Building, where all kinds of portable equipment is stored to be used in the event of any emergency right here at the Watts Bar site. Let's go take a look. The door is a, a military-grade blast door. It weighs approximately 95,000 pounds, but it's designed for all of the same tornado missiles and seismic events as the building. And it's approximately 16 inches thick. The outside shell is 24 inches thick, and the door itself is a 95,000 pounds that can actually be opened either electrically or manually by one person. This building is climate controlled to 40 to 80 degrees will maintain, and it has its own fire suppression system, its own electrical system. Gray boxes are the switch gear for the diesel generators and the power for the building. It'll have its own meals on wheels and cots and all of the amenities that go with having to have people stored here. The industry's response to Fukushima is emblematic of its eternal vigilance and the pride it takes in always trying to be better, even when it's already the best. Reporting from the Watts Bar Nuclear Plant in Spring City, Tennessee, I'm Mitch Singer from NEI's media team.